You're watching the Steve's Haunted Yard Channel. Get your haunt on. Yard Hunter 5 and here's one of the uh, update videos from stuff I've been working on in the past uh, that I did in the that a uh, couple of videos ago to show you guys what would be up and coming this is a pickaxe 08 proto board okay the board uh, when you order the kit it comes with the board and these components here. Um, this is your proto prototype side uh, to create for whatever function you're trying to create it with. Uh, it has the pickaxe chip that comes with the kit and this battery pack to power your your chip. This is the completed board um, after I've soldered on all of the three pin header strips. Uh, these three bottom uh, pins work, and this top pin. This middle pin is not active at this time, and then this uh, top pin up here is for power supply. I have found a power supply that works with servos. This board can run servos or LEDs. This is the power supply that I'm using, and I just put a little uh, two-pin quick connector on there, and that will connect on the bottom part of that three pin header which will give power to my pins here to run servos so what I'm going to use this board for in the program that uh, uh, Steve Kochi uh, has written this is this board will be used for a random three axis skull movement eventually when I can get the parts for a 3 axis skull next year. It will not be something for this year. Uh, I just can't do it for this year. But at least I'll have the proto board uh, for that project. So here is some footage from the virtual part. Um, check it out and then I'll show you what this does. We're doing our uh, I don't think that's what I want. a Should virtual make and take, and we're doing a uh, pickaxe really, really zero eighty proto board, and we're about to download a program if, to test the board to see if we can get this LED to to work. I so, can find the link. pretty cool stuff. Okay, we just wrote this code within pickaxe. To test test the code, we hit the simulate button, and now this is simulating the LEDs going off. The rest of you guys, take your Pretty cool. Hey, hey Steve, how fast? Yeah, Christy. I've got a little capacitor, one of those hundred capacitors. It's just a little brown thing. Uh, is there a way to be in the C1 area? Oh. No, it can go either way. Okay, now that you saw the virtual online part, I have my batteries in my battery pack, which is powering my pickaxe chip. I have my wall wart hooked up to the uh, top left pin to run my servos. Now, Let's hook a servo to it. Now the program in here for the three axis movement isn't 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 on here. Here, let me move this down so I can set this set this joker down. Kind of hard to hold all this. So there it is. So here's my servo. I only have one servo at this time. So this is just a test. And there you have it. This uh, pickaxe board is running this servo. If I had three servos, 
I could hook up three servos and they would all three uh, be uh, doing random movements. Uh, once I put the actual real random code that was written in here by uh, Steve and several other people, it, it won't really move in this manner. It'll be more of a random movement. This is a code that's in there just for testing to make sure that you can get your servos to run. So I can move this. Hold on a second here. Let me move this to another pin. That's the middle pin, three pin header. And there you have it. So, introducing Steve Honig Yard's very first pickaxe project. That's some pretty good soldering. Look at this. Look at that there. Not bad. Not super good, but not super bad. <laughs> Out of uh, these right here, in particular, pretty awesome. Sorry for the grainy footage there. It's kind of not real dark, not real light in here. Sun's going down. It's not quite so bright. But there it is. Pretty awesome. So if you stick around, in about two years, I might have a three X's skull. <laughs> All right, guys, thanks for watching, and get your haunt on. One last thing, guys. I got an email today from Circus of Souls HP. He's a new YouTube vlogger. He just uploaded his fir very first YouTube vlog today. Um, give him a shot. Uh, he asked if I would uh, mention him. So there it is. Good luck, man. Got to build some cool stuff and have some good content for people to watch you. So uh, if I give you the shout-out, don't let me down, man. So uh, keep vlogging and show some cool stuff. But you guys go check him out and uh, give this guy some encouragement. That has been a public service announcement from Steve's Hunter Yard. Please subscribe today.